today's guide to life is all about my wedding day so i'm kind of really excited and my groom is still here i thought he might have disappeared you know down in chandler bing but no he's still there so we're gonna watch over him make sure he doesn't run away so i came to folino um at about nine and uh first thoughts about when I was entering the place was like it's freaking grand and like so beautiful and it really really fits the team very well so it's quite cool because just now everyone was fussing over me people from Moosh came to do my hair and like Keith especially came early to sort of dress me up okay so I designed with this dress for today for her RM it was actually inspired by um the mafia team so it was actually supposed to be a little bit um uh slight mysterious but I wanted to make it more a little bit more fun so I actually took inspiration from Marilyn Monroe as you can see the hotel neck when Wendy came to me she told me that she wanted you know it to be like really really poofed up so I thought that would be quite fun and cute because she's quite pretty and she knows she'll really look good with it is really short so that was what we came up with yeah she was involved in the whole design process as well I'm really at ease with it. I've had four years to think about it, so um, I'm not really nervous. Uh, I'm more excited, um, feeling quite good about it. A little bit anxious, but I realized that I don't have to memorize my vows, so that's okay. That's great. Yeah. So uh, all I have to do is to listen to the solemnizer and say, I do, and then I will. And then if nobody objects, that's it. It's over. Just eat. I'm looking forward to the food also. This is five minutes from the start of the ceremony. I'm being left alone in the room because I'm supposed to like make a grand entrance and everybody's seated outside and my dad is so gonna give me away to Mike. So I'm very nervous. Huh? It's like I feel like I will I will cry later. Hi, good morning ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Thank you for joining me here today to witness the solemnization ceremony of Mr. Michael Sayer and Miss Cheng Yen Yen Wendy. And the two witnesses together with me today are Madam Ip Sao Ying on my right and Miss Yeo Su Ying on my left. Before I commence with the solemnization ceremony, can I just check with the two witnesses? Is there any objection to no. this solemnization ceremony? No. Last consideration for the bride. You confirm that he is your Mr. Right? I guess. <laughs> okay, since there's no objections, now we shall commence this solemnization ceremony. Mr. Michael Sayer, do you take this woman, Mr. Cheng Yen Yen Wendy, to be your wedded? Miss, sorry, Miss Wen Cheng Yen Yen Wendy, to be your wedded wife and live together in the legal estate of matrimony. I do. Will you love her, comfort her, keep her and honour her in sickness and in health? I will. For second of all others, be faithful to her as long as both of you shall live. I will. Miss Cheng Yen Yen Wendy, do you take this man, Mr. Michael Sayer, to be your wedded husband and live together in the legal estate of matrimony? I do. Will you love him, comfort him, keep him and honour him in sickness and in health? forsaking of all others. Be faithful to him as long as both of you shall be. I will. Mr. Michael Sayer, can I invite you to take the ring and put on Miss Cheng Yen Yen Wendy? Now, 
from this moment onwards. I shall pronounce you as Digger, Man and Wife. Once again, thank you. Thank you everyone for coming and for dressing to the team. You guys look really mafia-ish. It has not been an easy four years for me and Mike, especially in the beginning. So, um, you know, when we first started, I thought that we would never work out. Uh, but here we are today, four years ago, like, almost exactly on this day, we got together. So, tomorrow will be our four years anniversary. I want to also make a special thanks to Momo for uh letting me stay with her when I didn't have a place to live uh, or any money. He was very uh, poor. If not for her, we probably would never have worked out. Um, so thank you, Momo. Uh, how does it feel? Like it? Yeah, about the same as I was like five minutes ago when I wasn't married. You know, I was waiting for it to feel different, waiting for some sort of change, but uh, it's exactly the same and I'm glad <laughs> it is because it was good before and uh, I think it'll continue to be good. So. Aww, okay. We've come to the end of uh, my wedding solemnization and I guess also at the end of this episode. It's been a really great day, very fun and um, the cherry on top of the cake is just, you know, the food so fabulous. When I was eating the codfish, I felt like crying because it's like, it's so nice, everything is so nice. It would be so nice to me. Okay, so here we are, just married and I just found out that one of my friends, Ming, actually booked a room in the capella for me and Mike. So we're going to be staying there tonight. Quite exciting. There's a very nice hotel and I guess we'll be making babies. Hmm? Doing something. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. So this is Mike and Wendy signing off. Bye-bye.